The legals vote, Harris. If it's an actual fair, I mean, it's Trump. It's not even close. He talks shit, but he keep it real. Kamala, fucking liar. Yeah. You together? Not yeah. with. Not. <laughs> How do you ensure that what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas? Eh? We won't tell your wife. Okay, thanks a lot. Who's the prime minister of Australia? Yeah. Oh, I'm embarrassed to tell you. I know. I hear. Where are you from, play. Primo? Where are you from, <laughs> Primo? Election polls across this country say it's too close to call the election between Trump and Harris. While betting agencies have Trump way in the lead. So the billion dollar question is, are the polls right or are the markets right? We've come to Las Vegas to find out from the average punter what they think. Because the mainstream media is working overtime right now to play down the markets. This is on our tour at avacrossamerica.com. Remember, you can go there to see all our reports across the country. I started in San Francisco and I will end up in Mar-a-Lago for election day. Join us there and support our work if you like what you see. So let's cut the hype and let's hear from the average person. If you had to bet right now, who's oh. going to win the election, Trump or Harris? Uh, Trump. Trump all day. Trump. I hope it's Harris. Me. Harris. Harris? Yeah. I'd bet on Trump. Trump. My wife is pulling me. We don't. You're not going to bet? No. You're in Vegas. That's okay. Harris. Why? Because she's the baddest bitch on earth. Trump. Trump's a businessman. Honestly, Trump. 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 Trump all the way. Trump. Every time I gamble, it's a for sure fact. It's I lose. Okay, so then Even this. If I found a time machine and I went back and I fixed it. It would just go. Okay, so this is important. So I want to ask you the no, question: Trump or Harris? Who's gonna win? Trump, bitch! But they're gonna fuck him over and they're gonna him because the people are already in power. They already, they already took over the country. But what you just, what you just said is nuked. You, all, you always lose. You always lose. That's not a good sign. That is not a good sign. I think we're gonna have to cut the, cut him. No. <laughs> Funny. Who's gonna win? I'm voting for the independent. Not what you're voting for, I'm asking who do you think is gonna win? Trump. Now see, let me tell you something, I ain't gonna tell y'all my secrets. Who's gonna win, who's gonna win? You know who's gonna win? No, I'm just, we're asking people, we're in Vegas, we wanna know where to put the bets. Where should the punters put their money? Is it behind Harris or is it behind Trump? <sighs> I don't know, Trump getting a bad deal right now, buddy. He is. Popular vote Trump. Trump. Why? I don't have time, I'm working. I'm sorry. Harris. Is that what you want or is that what yeah, you think? It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen? Guarantee. Oh, I guarantee it, Trump's gonna win. Why? Because he's a bigger badass than what Kamala is. You know what, that's for the people to decide. But a bet, a bet. I know you're not gambling on the job. But you're saying bet. A free bet, you're not gambling on the job. Who's gonna win? I'd go ask the odd makers inside. We're in Vegas, we just wanna know betting. Would you put your money where your mouth is? Would you actually oh bet? Yes, I would. How much would you put on Harris? Whatever I have. Yeah, I would. You know you should do it because the odds are really good for you. Yeah, I know. If the legals vote, Harris, if it's an actual fair, I mean, it's Trump. It's not even close. Is that what you want or is that what you think is going to happen? Uh, I think that's supposed to be what we want. I just drove here from Dallas, man. All I see is Trump signs everywhere. I ain't even seen a Kamala sign anywhere. <laughs> oh, you're not saying. <laughs> Uh, what, That's what? just my opinion. I feel like he's going to win. I'm not a betting man. I just got to hope and pray. Why do you hope Harris? Uh, because I think the country is in trouble if Trump gets gets elected again. Um, She's a badass bitch. Kamala's cool, but she be lying about a lot of shit. Trump, he talks shit, but he keep it real. Kamala a liar. Kamala. You ever watch her laugh? She's crazy. Do you think Harris is going to win or you just don't like Trump? Both. Trump. I get the sense it's not what you want. No, it's not, but that's a bad Yeah. It's if it definitely is, what we want. If, if it doesn't get rigged, if it doesn't get rigged, it's going to be Trump. I'm a Trumper. Oh, you're a Trump. Absolutely. You, hold on. This has got so much more interesting. Yeah. So you guys it's are married? My husband, yeah. yeah. Yes. And and you're I, I'm not very political. You're not very yeah. political. But like yeah, I, no. you'd say that it's pretty divisive. Like relationships have broken yeah. down yeah. over but with you guys, it doesn't affect you. No, uh, no. Best country in the world. Just before we get back into the video that I'm sure you're loving, but if you can believe it, gets better. I have a quick message for our US viewers from one of our sponsors who are making this 
possible. Kamala Harris, the Liberal California politician, the furthest left major party candidate America has ever seen, could become the next president of the United States. This should frighten you to your core. She supported open borders. She's failed you as the current borders are. And she even helped raise money to get criminals out of jail. This could be a disaster, not only for your safety, but also the economy at large. Have you seen her new tax plan? It could be the nail in the coffin for the country. That's why you have to stop what you're doing right now and reach out to the top rated precious metal company, Goldco. Goldco has over 6,000 five-star reviews, a bunch of awards, and has helped people just like you purchase over two and a half billion dollars in gold and silver. Visit rebelnewsforgold.com to get your free 20 to 25 gold and silver kit, plus up to a 10% instant match on bonus silver for qualified accounts. Visit rebelnewsforgold.com. That's rebelnewsforgold.com just after you finish watching this video. You know what? It's a business, I man. I don't give a f Trump stepped I'm, on Australia. I'm new. Trump stepped I'm on new. China. And Trump stepped on new. In no Russia, sport. Trump stepped on everybody. You know he was like, when he was a president, he was like this, like, and you know what? Is that good? I'm running shit, and this is how shit's gonna go. It's one of the lesser evils that's gonna win because she just is worse. The polls have been pretty even, but the betting agencies have Trump way ahead. Why do you think there's a difference? Because America wants Trump to be president. Easy as that. All the working class, um, they want Trump because they they, they know what. What is it? Who do you want to win? Trump. But off camera. <laughs> <laughs> Trump is hitting the nerve of the people right now. You know, people want lower inflation and people want to be able to live free without government intervention. And I think that's what it comes down to. The Democrats want to, you know, like rally behind it. They own the media, everything, you know. So that's probably why, just to keep some faith going on the party. Oh! fake propaganda is confusing. It's about to breed confusion, that's all. There's more poor people than there are rich people. Do you think it's only rich people voting for Trump? I think it's a lot of um, people that are white. Kamala? <laughs> up. Oh, Kamala, she's oh, gonna I'm fuck it up, up even more, homie. All of them up. Hey, Everyone I'm I'm up. The only I'm good, the only good president that, say. the only Who good president that there ever was was Trump. I've spoken to a lot of black people that tell me they're voting for Trump. Um, he don't even like them. They don't. He doesn't, he doesn't like, like them. He doesn't like us Mexicans either. A lady over here just told me, she's a, I think she was Mexican, she said no person of colour will really be voting for Trump because he hates them. Nah, Trump don't hate nobody. Trump colour is green. If you out, if you making money, he with you. That's the bottom line. It's all about money. Like, Trump gonna treat this shit like a business. That's, that's what Trump do. So why do you think so many people are voting for him? So many people that are of color. There's a lot of people of color that I speak to, they're voting for Trump. Do you really think that? I, I'm saying when I'm- Like the majority. Like, do you think there's more poor people than there are rich people? I, I don't know. I'm pretty. I'm pretty no, poor. Be honestly, like yeah, that's probably more poor people. But I don't know. Are poor people voting against Trump? I just think that he's looking out for them than he is more looking out for us. You don't think Let's Trump see. hates Mexicans? No. You know what? Maybe. Uh, Trump you know what? Those f***ing cartel pieces of shit that kill motherfuckers. That shit. That's, that's, that's real that's shit. Not, so you guys think that Trump doesn't hate Mexicans? He hates cartels. Yes or no? Yes or no? Do you think? Yeah. Right. Hey, you we the cartel. What do you love about Kamala? Something she's done in the last four years. I just think that she knows what it's like to be poor. She was raised by her mother, who is like a single mother, right? Like, I just think she's more realistic than he, he was born with the silver spoon. And, like, you know what? Like, he what has she done in the last four years that you like? And One thing. I don't think she was in charge. She wasn't the president. I mean, her whole stance on shit and had she. I lock us up for like, man, she used to be a, a, a come on, man. She don't, man, she don't care, but look, she denied that she was black, didn't she? I believe she do a good job for the whole country. Like what, an example? She leads for everybody. She wants everybody to benefit. What would you say to the average Harris supporter? I mean, just do your research, you know? Uh, look at the data and educate yourself. I mean, she said she's Indian, right? Or she says she's black. I don't know as well as that is. I mean, that, that's, that's one, <laughs> of, that's one <laughs> of 80 know, you things. You cannot win like, you know? people by race. You cannot yeah. like, play the race game. Right. I'm not from, I'm, I don't grow up in America. I came Where'd you grow up? I'm a great, I'm a great, in Libya. 
Libya. Yeah, yeah, I came from Libya. So if you appreciate this country, right, you get out of here from real though. Like all his people like resigned and all that bullshit that happened on January 6th. Like, I don't have respect for someone that can do that to our capital. Like, I just don't. As far as presidency, it don't really f***ing matter because they puppets anyway. I mean, once uh, he got shot, I mean, there's no denying he was a badass after that, right? He got up. What? I mean, let's be honest. If if Biden got shot, he'd probably still be in, what, the hospital? Hospice care? I mean, he's in, still in hospice. But more. I don't think it would have made any difference. What? If Biden been shot, he'd be True. in the same state. Yeah, exactly. Actually, that's a good point. That's a good Point. Do you want another woman to run your life, the President Harris? No, good. Do you want another woman to run your life? She's the boss, I'm good. Do you want Trump or Harris? No, I don't know. Okay, but well, let me tell you. He's the head, I'm the neck. I tell him which way to turn his head. I can tell. <laughs> I think that Trump is better because he's a... Oh, sorry, I'm a little bit drunk. I think he's a little bit better because... The shit that he stands for, he will f***ing fight for our American country. Are we not the big the brother to us? Two other countries for some f***ing bullshit ass reason. No. I don't know why. The, the bullshit ass why. reason is I don't know why. because I don't the country, know why. The I don't country know why. can't f***ing back themselves up. Is it true what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas? Vegas? Absolutely. Yes, kind of, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. That's right. It's kind of girls know about it. Depends on what you do. I mean... We, we have our friends here, like, yeah. you, you cannot do something stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Come Absolutely. Are you together? Not yet. Yeah, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can film it, but what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Eh? We won't tell your wife. Okay, thanks a lot. <laughs> How do you ensure that what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas? You gotta go to a car, I don't know, man. Sorry. sorry about that, brother. That's not cool. That's not cool. I feel like... They're not protecting people's civil rights here. Of course. Oh, okay. Why not? <laughs> of course. <laughs> no, I didn't understand that. How many of you have uh, uh, misses at home? This guy. About all. Two, of us. three, all of you? I don't. No. I don't. You don't? No. no none of us do. <laughs> none of us do. We're in Vegas. We're at my bachelor party. Yeah. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas? Or did you just get stuck in Vegas? I got stuck in Vegas. <laughs> I got stuck in Vegas. Uh, listen, if I didn't have a wife and children at home, I could see how that could happen. Yeah. I love you, babe. Hangover four, is it? Yes, yes exactly right. our thought. That's, the goal. That, that's our uh, motto. Teeth? Yeah. Good. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck, boys. America, chill the f out, honestly. Say Africa goes to the war. Fuck out, honestly. Who are they gonna f call on? Hey, I love America, boy. Damn, Who are they gonna call on? Chill the out. The, the big brother, the the big brother is the United leader. States, oh, and United States oh. is the president. Who's the prime minister? Of Australia? Yeah. Oh, I'm embarrassed to tell you. I know, I hear. Albanese. Okay. Do you know who that is? Uh, I don't hear good things. <laughs> That's a Trump from you? Get the f out of here, you're not funny. I'm, I'm happy for you. I look you're older than you. I deem me as much Whatever as Whatever you're doing, you're doing Great. Thank you, brother. Yeah. <laughs> You're doing oh, no, but I got my license on me. I actually bought it. We're gonna put some salt in there. And just salt again. Don't get excited. <laughs> my birthday is my birthday. Great. Happy birthday. Man. Thank you, brother. Happy birthday. Well, if you can't beat them, join them. And they keep telling me what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. So don't tell my boss that I'm drinking on the job. It'll be our little secret. Cheers. enjoyed this report as much as I had filming it make sure to like comment but most importantly share it far and wide because the mainstream media is working overtime to pretend like none of this is true the polls in the market they don't match for a reason so it's up to you guys news, baby. what's listen happening up. The, listen up listen up Rebel News he's right he has a point <laughs> Rebel News and you can get our reports across the country at avacrossamerica.com and if you support our mission here, make sure to chuck in a couple bucks to help us cover the costs. The RV, the RV stops, the flights, the food, everything. We cannot do it without your help.